I was born with spastic diaplegic cerebral palsy. Charter stations are a lot more fickle. There's the actual access to the station itself, but the way that they have built them now is, is inaccessible for the largely for the most part. I, wireless charging honestly would be the greatest impact to people with mobility disabilities since the creation of the car. This has the capability to be the complete wave of what the next evolution of a car should be. I don't even think that it's just for people with mobility disabilities. I think wireless charging has the capability to be used by everybody. Because once you realize what it does, nobody is getting out of their car. Everybody is gonna wanna be on that pad. <laughs> you know, I feel like it's a very forward thinking move that, you know, like more and more people, including the DOT, should be getting behind because it just makes sense. But yeah, in terms of the ways and things that it will do for uh, people with disabilities, like that is a literal game changer. Wireless charging, for me is about autonomy. That's really, it's, it's, and it's more about respecting a person's time. So, you know, it's about the ability for me to do what I wanna do when I wanna do it. And so it is independence, but I also think it's about valuing yourself.